Hello. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to first calibrate um, image J to make measurements, and second, how to um, measure the length of the object on an image. Okay. Um, so image J is a piece of free software um, that you can download freely and install on your computer. Um, so if you haven't got that, please go and download it from the website and install it. So to begin with, I'm going to open up this calibrator image. Now, a calibrator image um, has to be one that is taken at the same magnification as the sample that you want to measure or you want to analyze. Um, and also, the size of the object in the calibrator image has to be known as well. So in this case, for example, we know that the distance between that point uh, on the image and that point is a thousand micron. So a micron is a micrometer. Okay, so we're going to use this image to calibrate our measurements. So to do that, we need to draw a line. Um, so I'm going to click that icon there. Draw a line from that point to that point. Okay, so now we know that that line is a thousand microns uh, in real life. So I'm going to tell Ms. J to set that scale. So I go to analyze and set scale. Okay, so image J has um, uh, determined that that length, that line, is 424 pixels. Um, the known distance is a thousand micron. So I'm going to change that known distance to a thousand. Keep aspect ratio the same as one. And that basically means whichever direction you measure, the same scale is always applied uh, on the same image. The unit of length is micron. Okay, I will click that global. Um, I will click that box. Um, and what that does is it makes image J remember uh, this conversion factor. So that if you then close this image and open up other images, image A will apply the same uh, scaling factor to those images as well. Click OK. So the scale has now been set. So image J is now uh, calibrated for our measurements. Now I will then open up the image that I want to analyze. Um, say for example, I want to measure the length of that microneedle. Um, so all I need to do is draw a line again from the tip of that microneedle to the center of its base. Okay, so I'm interested in that length. To tell image J to measure it, I go to Analyze and click Measure. You can also press Control M on your keyboard. And image J will then do the measurement, and in this case, it's determined that the length is 910 micron. Okay, so that's how you make measurements in image J. Um, but before before you do that, you need to calibrate it, and I've shown you how to calibrate image J as well.